This is a beautiful sandbox game called Ermocraft. This is about building a machine to fight other people with their machines. It's rather simple in the idea. You build it out of blocks, as you can see this thing. It's made out of these tiny cubes of various shapes. Of course, you can have much bigger ones and even these really, really small ones here at the front. All of them have a huge variety of stats, health, mass, connection points, range on weapons, movement speeds on movement parts. It's truly something. It's in many ways comparable, for example, to Space Engineers, if you have heard about that game, but way more focused on PvP. This, as far as I'm aware, only has player versus bot matches as the only PvE content you can do. You can make a huge variety of bots to fight other people with. I'm just mostly the helicopter guy. I make a lot of them in various shapes. These are, for example, drones that don't even use helicopters. They fly by using a lot of thrusters. But if we take a look at community creations, you have a lot of other options, close range, very close range, <laughs> long range. You can even combine different weapons, different movement parts. For example, this is a completely different style of helicopter to mine. However, this video is rather sad. And if you play this game, but are not interested in seeing the most overpowered and game-breaking thing you have ever seen in it, I'm not talking about building some sort of a super robot to destroy everyone. I'm not talking about some sort of simple exploit like combining, I don't know, wings and uh, mechanical legs to run around way faster. No, this is much, much more severe. So if you don't want your experience of this game getting ruined, please stop watching the video right now. If you want to try this game out, again, don't bother. You are probably never going to see someone use this against you. However, the reason why I'm showing this off this publicly is because recently one person did use it against us. The proof of it you can see in the thumbnail. My friend sent it to me after he had to deal with it. And like I said, please. Stop watching if you don't want to know how how you can completely destroy this game. Okay, so for those who haven't stopped watching, I assume you want to know you don't want to be at a disadvantage. And, well, let's get to it. I was building this thing. You can see the radar module at the top. And I was thinking to myself, can I not place it lower down? This is a huge thing in this game. If you are building something out of these bigger blocks, you will realize there is an issue. For example, you can't put these two guns right next to each other. You have to put them a significant distance away from each other. It would be really, really cool if you could just put them right behind each other, for example. Yeah, and I accidentally did it. I'm going to show you the method. The simplest way to do this is to use symmetry. This is a key part of it. Moving your bot to the side, lining it up, and 
And now, sp spamming left click and the button, in my case, M, to turn on and off symmetry. This might take several attempts. And you can achieve it like this. You can see now I have two guns right inside of each other. To show you this actually works, you can simply connect them and test out your bot. The game is very generous when it comes to this because you are not supposed to have been able to do that. As you can see, you can find a bot with 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 a bot Furthermore, you can simply block the first placement option. This was discovered by my uh, friend Kapas. I'll leave a link to his channel. He was in a voice call with me when I came up with this by accident. So, as you can see, it's roughly here. I just place a block here, so I can't place it. Now I just hold down left mouse button, and I press the button to turn on and off symmetry. You can see this flickering. It's happening because the game is trying to place it right now. And that was it. This is completely game breaking. If you are unaware what this means, let me put it differently. You can basically put any amount of blocks in effectively the same space. This thing now has the frontal surface of one gun, but it's actually four of them, and you would have to destroy all four of them to disable this bot from fire. This is also not limited to just guns. This, for example, works with hover blades. And yes, you can actually put them inside of other blocks. Let's make a quick example. It also works with thrusters. With basically any kind of block that is bigger than one cube. This absolutely destroys any meta in the game. It makes bots like this that I have made practically useless. Since you can, for example, stack four of these rotors right next to the gun, right behind it, then stack all the four hammers right next to it, even the modules, and you can even put the armor in front of the gun and the gun will shoot through it. <sighs> Thankfully, there is a solution. If you are a free gen developer, community moderator or whoever has influence on this game. I, 
he and my friends have figured out a few solutions to this. Since this relies on symmetry, the easiest option to prevent this from happening would be simply disabling symmetry. I know this sounds really harsh, but for a lot of very well-made and optimized designs, you don't need symmetry whatsoever. And it will at least prevent people from creating more of these. To stop people from even using the existing ones, because right now, even if you would stop me from using symmetry, I would still have a bunch of these broken combinations of blocks saved, and I could abuse it against other people. You would need to run a check for the entire database and either delete all parts that are bigger than one cube or at least rerun the building in whatever way you want I know all this block to newest top to bottom simply make a program that would run the building process like a player for each bot player has in their inventory or garage. I know this sounds like a lot of work, but there is no other way. You could also do the most harshest one and delete everything everyone has, but I don't think that's a viable option. Please don't use this against other people. Be aware of it. Maybe call people out for using it if you see that. It's not hacking. The, I'm not even aware of any hacks for this game, by the way, or anyone would ever use them, in, since this requires a lot more than just fast reaction times, or for example, an AI can't play this for you, at least not yet. So please, don't Use it. It absolutely destroys the game. It makes all existing designs obsolete and pointless. Since you can, like I mentioned, make things that are just as good, but way smaller. And it, as you might have realized, shooting a bigger target is always easier. And that's just an insurmountable disadvantage. In a highly competitive and let's say, it, discovered game like this, where people already know what are the best options and how to make very good designs. But please, be aware of it. If you can, tell FreeGem, tell the developers, tell whoever you know can have any influence on this, the guys who are making the community patches, whoever. Tell them about this. Ask them to please fix this. Show them this video. Show them the solutions I presented. And also, remember, this is just a game. If someone uses this against you, it doesn't mean they are somehow necessarily a bad person. Maybe they, are, they just wanted to have a little bit of an advantage. Whatever. They don't need to be evil to use this, as with any things in this game. They are neither somehow cheating or hacking and shouldn't be banned for it, but the game should be fixed. Please also don't upload bots like these to the factory or basically the equivalent of this game's Steam Workshop or anything else like that. Please also don't use this in some sort of tournament. I know there are still people playing this game competitively. Please don't. It is a nightmare to moderate this because you would have to take each and sing every single bot apart and check every single combination of blocks on it if it's legal or not. So, I hope you appreciated me showing this. 
I could have kept the secret. I could have used this against you. I I could have I don't know called this some super secret mega tech and never told anyone and just laughed at people as I blew them up using it. But I didn't. I don't have a single bot that uses it. I never used this in any game, not even in custom games because we kind of couldn't get over to actually try it. You even tested how well it works. It does, sadly. And I, that's why I hope you appreciate me sharing this. So please like this video and most importantly, share it with others. So they are aware of this and have a nice day.